Hey guys, I want to share this story with you. A sex offender that was arrested in New York City for killing someone with the sword claims to be a serial killer, and I'm going to read what the New York Post has written about this. The tatted sex offender who was recently busted in New York for allegedly murdering an elderly man with a sword is now claiming to be behind a whole series of slayings across the country, dating back to when he was 12, officials said Wednesday. The NYPD arrested 32-year-old Nicholas Brent Gibson, also known as Brent Savage, on a lower Manhattan subway platform Sunday for allegedly killing 77 year-old Eric Stalker in his Florida apartment. After his arrest, Gibson claimed to have committed murders in Florida, California, and Georgia, going far back as 1999, when he would have been around 12 years old, Miami police said. We are evaluating the information he has provided, a statement from the Miami Beach Police Department said. We will be working with law enforcement in these locations in attempt to determine the credibility of the statements. Gibson also admitted to his involvement in stalker death, the department added. Authorities believe Gibson had worked as a health aide to Stalker, whose body was found at least 10 days after he was killed with a sword in mid-April, sources told the Miami Herald. Gibson was convicted in Illinois for aggravated sexual assault in 2000 and spent the next seven years behind bars, according to the Miami Herald. In 2008, he was locked up again for another four years for having sex with an underage girl, according to state prison officials. A transit officer in the Big Apple spotted Gibson on the southbound L train platform at the First Avenue station at about 9.35 a.m. Sunday after recognizing him as a suspect in Stalker's murder and cuffed him after a brief struggle. Gibson was charged with resisting arrest, obstructing governmental administration, and as a fugitive in another state, cops said. So I just wanted to share this article with you all. Um, if you have any more information about this case, leave me a comment below. Or if you just want to give me your opinion on it. These cases get crazier by the day. Um, it's going to be interesting to see if he really is a serial killer or if he was just lying to authorities.